Well, welcome back to the Lawn Care Grandpa channel. I appreciate you coming by to let us ramble a little bit more about landscaping, lawn care, that kind of thing. Today we've got a pretty interesting uh, question. Um, can you mow your lawn on Sundays? Now, there, it may seem self-explanatory, but there are some, some different nuances in it. So that's what we're going to talk about today. We've got Jerry McMillan here uh, with us. He's had over 40 years of landscaping and lawn care experience, and I worked with him for 10 years. So what we're going to do today is answer this question. If you have any other questions that you'd like to answer, put them down in the comments below. We'll try to make some videos for you. All right, so let's get started. So what would you think if someone were just to come up and ask you, is it okay to mow your lawn on Sunday? Actually, I've been in business for a long time, and I get a lot of thoughts going through my head as I uh, get that question. If you're doing it, uh, say you're a homeowner and you have a busy week and you have no other day but Sunday, you don't really want to bother neighbors. Hopefully they won't be interrupted in doing whatever they do. And uh, maybe it's not against the law in your neighborhood, but uh, if you're a business and you're doing it, the only way you'd want to do it on Sunday is if you were way behind and you'd ask the homeowner if you could do it and uh, not be bothering them, but have permission. Okay. You know, I've heard some people say that it's not even legal in certain areas for professional crews to do it on Sunday. Have you heard anything like that? Actually, I've never ran into a situation like that, but I have heard of it. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of neighborhoods will be very strict. They don't want someone waiting until Sunday to make all that racket while they're either taking a nap or watching TV. Yeah. So let's say it's Sunday, Sunday morning, we're early. How early do you think, if I'm going to want to mow my grass as a, as a homeowner or, if, let's say, a landscaping crew is doing it, how early do you think is, is early? Well, as long as it's legal and as long as the homeowner uh, is okay with it and you're able to work at your own uh, schedule, then you'd probably want to wait till later in the day, at least until around 1 o'clock or later, so that it would be dry, as dry mm -hmm. as possible. That yeah. would be an yeah, important yeah. thing. Yeah, so it's not even just the neighbors and the noise. It's also the dry because you don't want a lot of dew on the ground. Well, if you have permission to do it and you're not going to be bothering somebody that's going to get real upset, sure, do it, at, do it in the afternoon. Yeah, okay, but it's, it's better to do it in the afternoon because it could be wet. You're always looking for dry grass. It'll cut cleaner and it'll do a, a better job and uh, healthier because you don't want to tear the grass off. You want to cut that's why we always have to sharpen our blades a lot. Yeah. So, I know you, you run landscaping crews for decades, so you, you know you have to go early in the morning to some night, because you've got to start your day early enough, especially when it's super hot in the middle of the day. A lot of landscaping crews will do it super early so that they can get most of their work done before it gets too hot. So how early, let's say during the week, not even on a Sunday, how early on a day would you, would you go? Well, if you're going to do it early, it probably doesn't matter a lot. The later in the day, the, the drier it will get. But if you're going to do it early, say 8 o'clock or 9 o'clock, uh, the grass is not going to look very good, so you may have to go over some areas twice. And if it piles up a little bit because it's wet, you can use a mower to kind of spread it around. But those things will uh, eat up some of your time, and you might make less money on the job. But... If you have to get it done, you have to get it done. So yeah. Sometimes schedules mandate it. You have to work around your um, schedule. All right, so if you had the perfect time, let's say, because you know there, there's there's these guys, they want uh, they want their grass on their front lawn, especially, to look like the green, a putting green. So what time of day, if you want to have the best lawn, what time of day is the best time to, to mow? I would uh, think around our area, the southeast, somewhere between 3.30 and 4.30. Okay. Depending on maybe a shady areas might need to wait a little later. A sunny part could be cut earlier. You know, they're going to get drier faster. But anyway, I always enjoyed it. And if you're doing something that uh, makes a neighbor happy, that's the main thing, especially a customer. Yeah, so finding, working with what's the best for your grass and where it's dry and cuttable, but also what are your neighbor's schedules. Right, you want to make people happy. Yeah. Okay, well, that's all we have for this one. Um, if you like these videos, click like, subscribe so you can see some more of them, and come back and see us, and we'll answer some more of your questions. And uh, uh, appreciate you uh, answering all these questions for us. It, it's rare that you have experience like this, that you can just ask any question. So this is a good opportunity for us to, to learn from someone's experience, not just from a text. So 
Um, anything you like to say about mowing on Sundays? Well, it's it's rare if I run into a problem I haven't already had. So uh, just ask what you will, and we'll see what we can come up with.